So we're gonna start down on the hands and knees. So hands under the shoulders, knees under the hips. And from here, we're gonna tuck the tailbone, pushing the middle of the back up, and we're gonna exhale all the air out of your lungs. Good. And then press your chest toward the floor, think back of the head toward the tailbone, inhale through the nose, and exhale. And we're just gonna continue this. Inhale, and exhale. Give me a couple more here, inhale, exhale. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, and exhale. Push the middle of the back up, clear the air out of the lungs. Good, let's return the spine to neutral. Right leg only, we're just gonna lift it out to the side, and we're just gonna pump this for about 10 seconds here. That's right, keep it going. Today's just gonna be a, a circuit. I've got 12 exercise, or sorry, 10. Uh, exercises and we're just gonna move through those about three times go ahead and switch legs so it's gonna be real simple here simple not easy and again like I said we're gonna be using bands and body weight but all of these band exercises can also be done with dumbbells if you uh, don't have bands all right let's go ahead and come back to our quadruped stance and take your left hand behind your head and let's rotate the elbow internally toward the opposite elbow and then rotate externally and look under the arm as you do. And let's just go ahead and repeat that here. Good. And really push that bottom hand into the mat as you reach that top elbow up. Look under the elbow as you do so your eye line is following along. Excellent, let's switch sides. We go internal into external rotation. Feel that twist through the torso, back of the shoulder. There we go, three, two, and one. Excellent, let's return back to our hands and knees. And then from here, let's go ahead and tuck the toes under and push the tailbone up to the ceiling and press your chest down and back towards your feet. Good, and now from here, I want you to take your right hand and reach towards your left foot and try to touch it. Good, and then drop your hip back down into a plank position and let's push back up and do the opposite side. Try to tap the opposite foot, and let's repeat that. Lift the hip, tap the opposite foot. Dropping the hip in between each rep. Let's keep that going. Give me a few more here. Get a little stretch on the hamstrings here. Working through the shoulders, pressing up through the hips. In three, two, one, good. Let's hold this down dog position here. Good. And then walk your hands back to your feet. Keep your feet wide. And if they aren't wide, go ahead and widen them. Get a nice wide stance here. And then from this wide stance, let's walk both feet over towards your left foot. Good. Think chest to the knee. Lock out the elbow or the knees. Push the knees back. Folding at the hip. Good. Swing it over to the other side. Think chest to the knee. That's right. Breathing here. Let's go ahead and drop the torso right down the middle. You can grab your elbows here and let the weight of your arms pull the torso a little further to the ground. Good. And then from here, go ahead and place your fingertips back on the floor. And let's walk the hands in now to about hip distance. And we're going to drop into a nice deep squat. So drop those hips down. Your chest is up. You're going to push the knees out with your elbows. Press your palms together here. Good. Excellent. Let's take the left hand, grab the right ankle, and reach your right arm up to the sky. Good, and you can press that left arm inside the left thigh to get a little extra rotation there. Go ahead and switch sides. Right there. Excellent. Good, and then both elbows back inside the thighs. Place your hands on the floor, lean forward, and push those knees out just a little bit further. There we go. And let's rock back to your heels and then straighten both legs, drop your head. One little stretch on the hamstrings and then a slight bend to the knee and curl the spine as you roll up one vertebrae at a time. <sighs> Good, let's get some shoulder rolls going. <laughs> Excellent, you guys know, you know. Good, let's go both directions. Real simple here. Good, and let's work the neck. So hands on the hips, chin to the chest, let's roll the neck around. We're gonna go a few times one way, breathing into it, and then go ahead and switch directions. Good. Let's warm up the shoulders, so look straight ahead, extend both arms out to the side, give me little circles here. Good, little circles. Yep, and now progressively make those circles bigger. Good, until they're as big as you can make them. There you go, opening up the chest, swinging the arms back. 
That's right. And now let's reverse direction. Good. Big circles to start. And now let's slowly make those circles smaller and smaller until we're back where we started, going the opposite direction. We're gonna hold this for 10 seconds. Good. And five, four, three, two, one. Good, and we're just gonna roll from side to side here. Make sure we're pivoting on the opposite heel, swinging the arms, rotating through the hip. It's real simple. Good. And now from here, we're gonna pick up the right knee and we're gonna open it out. Pick up the left knee, open it out. And just switching side to side. That's right. Good. Cool, and let's take this right into some jumping jacks. Tap the fingers, slap the thighs. Give me about 10 seconds here. So like I mentioned, we got about 11 exercises here. 12, because one is gonna be a two-parter. And we're just gonna work through those. Each one has a rep count to it. And we're gonna try to get through this whole list for three rounds. Extend your arms out in front of your chest, seal jacks. And that's your workout. And when we're done, we are done. Good. Excellent, get that heart rate up. And now let's pump the knees right here, swing the arms along with it. We're at an easy pace here. Good. Keep that going, five, four, three, two, one. Now pick it up. There you go, nice and fast, come on. Pick it up. Good. Give me five more seconds here, five, four, three, two, and time. All right, we are warm. So, like I mentioned, we got several exercises, so instead of going through all of them, we're just gonna go one at a time and do them as we go over them, real simple. First exercise is actually four exercises in one. So this is what I meant by, there's a lot of two, three-parter exercises. So this is a leg matrix. So we're gonna go 10 body weight squats into 10 jump squats, into 10 forward lunges, that's five on each leg, into 10 jumping lunges. So squat, jump squat, lunges, jump lunges. 10 is our rep count. And let's just get to it. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Give me 10 squats. Go one. Drop the hips. Let the knees bend out. Three. Good. Sink them down. Four. Five. Keep those heels on the ground. Six. Seven. Breathing into it. Eight. And nine. Good. And now we're going to do jump squats. Start at the bottom. Jump and swing the arms back. Land back in that squat. Three, we're going 10. Four, push the floor away. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Hands on your hips and forward lunge. Tap that back knee. One, good. We're alternating legs here. Going for 10. Three, try to get that back knee down. Four, breathe in. Five, good. Six, seven, chest is up. Eight, and nine, and 10, good, step forward. Drop that back knee down. Jump and switch 10 times and go for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, there's that burn, eight, nine, and 10. Whoo, shake them out. All right, excellent. Exercise number two. So I have a single leg push up on the menu here now. I understand that regular push-ups can be challenging, so single legs could be even more challenging. So if you're struggling with a regular push-up, then just do either knee push-ups or toe push-ups here. But if you can do the push-ups and you wanna give yourself a little extra intensity, pick one leg up. We're gonna do five on one leg and five on the other. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. All the way down, all the way up. One, two, slow on the way down, fast on the way up. Four, come on. Five, switch legs. One, keep it going. Two, come on. Three, and four, and five. Real simple, nothing to it. All right, it's band time, grab a band. If you don't have bands, I'll show you what you can do without bands. But first, let's go over this guy. 
You're gonna take your band, you're gonna step inside of it. You're gonna hook your thumbs around the top and then pull the band over your shoulders, reaching your elbows out. And now this is a front loaded band squat. If you don't have bands, just take a couple of dumbbells and hold them right here. All right, well anyway, either way, we're going 12 reps. Here we go. Reach those elbows out. If you need more intensity, just grab further down on the band. It's that simple. Here we go. 12 times. Three, two, one, and go. One, two. Try not to rush through it. Four. Good. Chest is up. Six. Come on. Seven. We're going 12. Eight. Nine. Good. Get those hips down. 10. One. And two. Excellent. We are gonna go into mini bands next. I'm gonna grab my mini band real quick. Mini bands, these little guys. All right, if you don't have one of these, I'll show you what you can do. But first thing, if you do have one, get it above or below the knee. Above the knee is gonna be a little easier than below the knee. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna step out into squats. More squats, son of a gun. We're gonna step out, squat, step together. We're gonna alternate legs stepping together. Make sure the knees do not collapse here. If you do not have bands, you're gonna squat and lift one leg out. And then squat and lift the other leg out. Either way, we're going for 20 reps, 20. Here we go. Three, two, one, step it out. Squat and one. Squat, that's two. That's right, three, four, come on, five, good. Get low in that squat, seven, eight, nine, that's halfway, one, come on, two, let's go, three, four, five, there's that burn, six, come on, Seven, 18, 19, ah, 20. Ah, excellent. All right, next we're gonna do some sprawls. Sprawl is kind of like a burpee, like a burpee, without the push up and without the jump. We wanna hop back into a wide stance. So what you will do, feet about shoulder width, hands go inside the knees, Hop out wide, hop back, and just simply stand. It's that easy. We're going 10. Three, two, one, go. Here, just stand. One, two, come on. Three, four, yep. Five, five more. Six, breathing. Eight. One more time. And 10, so simple. Nothing to it, grab your band. All right, next up, we are gonna do a single arm row. So you're gonna hold your band by the edges. You're gonna step on it with one foot. This other hand here is just to anchor this side of the band, but we're just gonna work one arm at a time. So if your left foot is back, you're only working the left arm, okay? Obviously, if you don't have a band, just do the same thing with a dumbbell. Now make sure you're pulling that band back towards your hip, not up to your armpit. Pull it back toward the hip, okay? We're gonna go for 12 on each side. Let's go, three, two, one, go. One, pull that shoulder blade back, two, three. It's gonna work that front leg, four. Come on, five, six, Seven, get that elbow up. Eight, nice flat back. Nine, 10, two more. One and two, beautiful. Switch sides, here we go. Three, two, one, we go. One, two, going 12. Three, four, let's go. Five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, one, and 
two. Notice that nice, steady rep count. We're not trying to fly through these. We're working on good form. Take your band now, fold it into a figure eight, and fold it in half. Okay, so now it's double looped. You're gonna step inside the band. Exactly, good. From here, you're gonna work your butt back. Get your chest over the band, grab the top, and we're gonna pull these top two loops all the way up, squeezing your butt at the top, push your butt back down. These are band deadlifts, obviously. Just hold dumbbells if the bands aren't available. We're going 15. Three, two, one, go. One, squeeze at the top. Two, three, keep pushing your butt back. Squeeze it at the top. Try not to over arch here like that. Stand up nice and tall. Good, what is this, seven, eight, let's go, nine, 10, I need five more. Five, don't let the shoulders collapse on you. Stand tall, four, three, and two, ah, one. Marvelous. All right, we're cruising right along. We're gonna hit the abdominals next. So let's come on down. You're gonna lie down on your back. Make sure everybody can see me here. Good. So we're gonna lie down. You're gonna lift your shoulders up. You're gonna put your hands under your butt and you're gonna reach your legs out in front of you. We're gonna go 10 leg lifts and then we're gonna go 10 circles to the right and 10 circles to the left. Now, if your neck bothers you here, you could just leave your head on the ground. But if you can get your shoulders off the ground, even better, okay? 10, 10, and 10, here we go, at my pace. Go, one, not too high. Two, shoulders up. Three, if you can. Four, come on, breathe. Six, seven, that's right. Eight, nine, don't let the feet touch the ground. Go circles left, go. One, two, come on, stay with it. Three, four, good. Five, six, that's right. Seven, eight, nine. 10, switch direction, go. One, two, three, that's it. Four, come on. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, you know what? 10, hold it there, give me flutter kicks, go. 20, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 20. I snuck those flutter kicks in, you know. I don't know, I just felt like we needed to add flutter kicks there. I don't have to say, it just, just felt right. <laughs> All right, come on up. Grab the bands. Now we're gonna do some good old fashioned curls. Real simple here. We're gonna do hammer curls. So your hands are gonna be neutral, palms are facing in. Step inside the band again. The further you grab down on the band, the more intensity you're gonna get, obviously. So let's get the intensity that you're gonna need to make 20 of these tough. Keep your elbows pinned to the rib cage. Bring your hands to your shoulders. We're going for 20. Here we go, three, two, one, go. One, keep in my pace, two, three, stay tall, four. Don't let those shoulders roll forward. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, ooh, one, come on. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, 20. Oh, woo, those burn. <laughs> All right, so look, before how we were doing the row, we were in this position, right? Now, we're gonna do kickbacks, band kickbacks from the same position. So you're gonna need a little bit more slack on your band. Right, right foot's back, right arm is loaded. Get the elbow up by your rib cage, right? You're just gonna reach back, straightening through the elbow. We're gonna go <clears throat> 10 on each side. Here we go, three, two, one, go. One, two, only the elbow moves, three. Everything else is in isolation. Five, squeeze the back of the arm. Seven, eight, we're going 10, nine, 10. Beautiful, switch sides, here we go, three, Two, one, go. Squeeze. Two, three, 
four. Focus on the back of the arm. Six, that full contraction when you straighten the elbow. Nine and 10. Beautiful. We have reached the last extra. Oh no, I'm wrong. No, second to last. I was jumping the gun. Beautiful. You're gonna stand on the band with your right foot. You're gonna grab the band with both hands at the top of the band. And you're gonna pull the band away from the right foot over the left shoulder and back. These are wood choppers. And obviously if you have a dumbbell, you can do the same thing with a dumbbell. But we're gonna do it with a band. Because bands are easy. They're nice and compact, they're mobile. Here we go. Three, two, one, we're going 12, go. One, two, three. Reach those arms away from you. Five, get the band over the opposite shoulder. Seven, eight, nine, 10, two more, and one, two. I get a little bit in the shoulders there as well. Switch feet, same thing, other side, three, two, one, we go, four, one, two, come on, three, four, five, six, seven, feel the core working, eight, feel the shoulders working, nine, 10, two more, here we go. One, and done. Now we have finished, reached the final exercise of our list. I don't know what you're thinking, we're gonna do this two more times? Yeah, we're gonna do all this two more times. Step on the band with your right foot. Grab it with your right hand. Take your elbow to the inside of the band so the band is on the back of the arm. And all you're gonna do is press it overhead and back. There might be a slight lean to the opposite side, that's fine. We're going 12 on each side, here we go. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, punch it up. Four, feel those obliques working. Five, six, seven. Yeah, you can get that little extra lean. What is this, 10, yeah? And one, and two, beautiful. Switch, switch it. Yep, step on the band, get the elbow inside. We're going to the left, or left arm, lean to the right if you need to, three, two, one, and go. One, two, three, come on. Four, five, six, seven, feel those obliques working, reach through the abdomen. Eight, nine, 10, give me two more. One, and done. All right, you guys remember all that? <laughs> what? I remember there were curls. All right, so we're gonna go leg matrix. That's <clears throat> 10 squats, 10 jump squats, 10 front lunge, forward lunges, 10 jumping lunges. Now we know what we're doing, so I don't have to spend so much time talking, right? That's a good thing. Here we go. 10 squats, go. One, two, stay on my pace. Three, four, five, full range of motion here. Six, seven, Think elbows to the knees. Nine, 10, now get to the bottom of the squat. Chop your arms back and jump, go one, two, three, four, five. Land back in that squat. Seven, eight, nine, 10, hands on your hips, forward lunges, go. One, try to tap that back knee, two, three. Think of 90 degree, elbow, uh, uh, 90 degree angles in the knees. Well, I think this is five, <laughs> six, seven. Don't count on me to count. Eight, I'm terrible at it. Nine, and 10. Back knee down, jump and switch. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Woo. Shake them out. All right, we got 10 push-ups or 10 single leg push-ups. Five on each side, either way, I need 10. Here's also another option for push-ups. If you're like in between knee push-ups and full push-ups, do this. Lower down slow, put your knees on the ground and lift up from the knees, okay? If you're in between, all right? 
Otherwise, knees or toes or single leg. Three, two, one, go. One, two, go in 10. Three, four, five, six, seven, I didn't switch. Eight, nine, and 10. All that single leg does is it just provides a little less balance to so get a little bit more core activation out of that. All right, we're back to squats. Grab your bands or your dumbbells. Woo, my heart rate's up. We're gonna pull the bands over the shoulders, reach your elbows in front of you, drop your hips, let your knees bend out. We're going 12, three, two, one, go. One, two, come on. Nice flat back here. Four, chest is up, five, Six, push the floor away. Seven, feel the heels on the ground. Nine, 10, two more, come on. One and two, you got that. That's too easy for you. Grab your mini band, above or below the knee. Easier, harder. Step out into squats or no bands, squat and reach. Either way, we're going. 20. Three, two, one. Step it out, squat, and back. Other side, two. Lots of squats today. Three, four, five. Don't let the knees collapse. Six, seven, keep it going. Eight, nine, halfway. One. Two, three, come on. Four, five, six, seven, three more. Three, two, and one. All right, we got our sprawl. We're going 10 reps. Remember sprawl, it's a burpee without the push up, without the jump. Hop back into a wide stance 10 times. Three, two, one, go. One, just stand. Two, bingo, come on. Three, four, five, stay on my pace here. Six, seven, eight, we're going 10, nine, and 10. Grab your bands. I'll grab your A band. Shoo! Okay, we got our single arm row. You guys should remember this one. Grab the bands by the edges. Step in the middle or step toward the working arm. Opposite arm is an anchor. And we're gonna pull back toward the hip. We're going 12 on each side. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. One, two. Three, four, five. Feel the shoulder blade pulling in toward the spine. Seven. Biceps are working here. Eight, nine, ten. We're going 12. One and two. Beautiful. Switch sides. Simple as that. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four. Focus on your upper back. Six, focus on your lats. Seven, eight, nine, 10, one, and two. I should say too, if you have trouble with grip, if you wrap the band around your wrist, you can hold it like so, you get a little better grip on that. Okay, deadlifts. Take your band, make a figure eight, and then fold it in half, stand inside. Remember deadlifts is all focused on glutes. Push your butt back, squeeze your butt forward. We're going 15, grab those top two bands. Push your butt back, three, two, one, come up, squeeze, one, push it back, two, three, squeeze your booty, five, stand tall, six, don't let the shoulders roll forward, Seven, 
Come on. Whoop. Eight. Good. Nine. Got a little caught up there. Ten. We're going five more. Five. Let's go. Four. Eight. Three. Two. One more time. One. Excellent. All right, we're down to the floor for some abdominals. Phew. Towel off if you need to. It's getting a little slippery over here. That's a little gross, wasn't it? A little bit. All right, lie back. Hands under your butt. Shoulders up if it doesn't bother your neck. Reach your legs out. 10 lifts. Three, two, one, go. One. Go up as high as I am. Two. About 45 degree angle. Three. Four. Stay on my pace. Five. Six. Good. Seven. Eight. Nine. Don't let the feet touch. 10. Circles left. Go. One. Two. Stay with it. Three. Keep those legs locked out. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Switch direction. Go. One. Two, three, four, come on. Five, six, seven, eight, yeah. Nine, give me those flutter kicks. 10, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 20. Marvelous. Pop up. Gun show. We're going curls. We're going triceps. Here we go, 20 times. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four. Stay tall. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more, come on, ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. There's something about the bands and curls. They just get the job done. We're going triceps next. So we're going back to that stance that we had with our row. This time we're just gonna straighten through the elbow. And again, we are gonna go 10 on each side. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, Six, breathe, seven, reach through the elbow, nine, and we switch sides, three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, good, five, six, that squeeze on the back, eight, nine, and 10. Beautiful, step on your band with your right foot. Good. With your palms facing down, grab that band with both hands. And we're gonna rotate over the opposite shoulder for 10. Go. One, two, three, four. Good. Five, six, seven. Get tall. Eight, nine, 10. Woo! Switch it. Three, two, one, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Aye. All right, let's switch back to our right foot. Right hand is loaded with the band, right foot is stepping on the band. We're going overhead press with a slight lean to the left. Three, 10 times each, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ooh, there's the shoulder. Eight, nine, and let's switch sides. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, come on, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. That was round two. 
done. And we have one more round. We got a cool 10, 15 or so minutes to get through it. So without further ado, let's do it. Here we go. Leg matrix, squats, jump squats, lunges, jump lunges, 10 each, three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four. Breathing into it, six, seven, eight, nine, good. 10, get to the bottom of the squat, chop the arms back, go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, hands on your hips, feet about hip distance, forward lunges, go one, two, chest is up, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, and you know what comes next. Let's do it, and three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, keep your chest up, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh man, shake them out. Upper body next, push-ups. You know which version you're doing? So let's just do it. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, good. Eight, nine, 10. I'll give you a few more seconds to complete those if you are still working on them. Good. Grab your band. It's gonna be squats and squats with squats next. Front squats, and then we step into our mini band squats. 12 front squats. Stand inside your band. Good, pull it up. Over the shoulders, reach your elbows out. Drop the hips. We're going 12. Go. One, two, three. That's right, four. Five, make sure the knees are tracking out. Six, toward the second toe of each foot. Drop those hips as low as you can. Nine, 10, give me two more. One, and two. Nothing to it. Nothing to it, grab your mini bands. Remember above or below the knee, the lower the harder. We're stepping out for 20, three, two, one, go. One, two, three, breathe into it. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Good, I need 10 more, let's go. 10, nine, eight, feel those hips working. Seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one. Good, we're to our sprawls. Keep breathing out there. I can't emphasize enough how important that is. We hold our breath so much, so make sure the breath is constantly moving. 10 sprawls, remember, it's a burpee without the push up or the jump. Wide stance, three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I need two more. Nine and ten. Grab your band. Oh, uh, yeah. Rose. Woo! This workout's kicking my butt. I rarely sweat during workouts, but these, oh man, it's a different story. All right, we're working the right arm. Right leg is back. We're here. We're going 12, three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
Keep pulling that arm back. Eight, nine, 10, two more, and one, two. Beautiful. Switch feet right away. Three, two, one. Let's go. One, two, three. Good. Four, five. Breathing into it. Six, seven, eight, nine. That's 10. Two more. One and two. Marvelous. All right, we got our deadlifts. Remember, take your band, make a figure eight out of it, and then fold that in half. Then we step on the inside, grab the top two loops. We're going 15. Here we go. Three, two, flat back. One, push your butt forward. One, push it back. Two, work those glutes. Three, four, don't let those shoulders roll forward. Five, six, seven. We're going 15, eight, Nine. Ted, give me five more. Five. Four. Good. Give me one more. And one. All right. Let's get those biceps again. We are back to our curls. Step inside. 20 curls on my pace. Three. Two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five. Only the elbows are moving here. Seven, eight, nine, oh, 10. 10 more, 10, nine, eight, seven. Come on, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh. Oh man, let's get those triceps. Phew, we don't quit today. All right, we're working the right arm. So right foot is back. Get the right elbow up to the rib cage and don't let that elbow drop down. Straight through it, we're going 10, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, come on. Nine, that's 10, nothing to it. Switch side, three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, 10. Beautiful. All right, let's foot drop it. Right foot on the band. Hold for this uh, pony the grip. Reach over the opposite shoulder. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three. Good. Four. Let your eye line follow your hands. Five, six, seven, eight. We're going ten. Nine. Good. Switch. Three, two, one. Go. One. Two, three, stay with it. Four, come on. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And we have arrived. This is the final exercise. We'll do a quick cool down before I let you go. Right foot on the band, right hand loaded, the elbow inside the band. Lean and press 10 times. Go. One, two, three, four. Feel the torso working. Five, six, seven. That's right. Eight, nine. That's 10. Switch sides. Let's finish this up. Three, two, one. Go. One, two, three, four. Try to lock out that elbow. Five, Six, seven, come on. Eight, nine, this is 10, beautiful. All right, everybody, come on down to the mat real quick. 
Couple more minutes and I'll get you out of here. Let's go ahead and go into a seal stretch. So drop your hip to the floor and lift up through your chest. Look up at the ceiling and breathe. Good job today. That was a tough one. Great thing about these bands, you can throw them in a suitcase, take them anywhere. Take them to a park, push back into a child pose, and you got a whole gym with you. Walk both hands over to the left side and stack your right hand on top of your left. So there are no excuses, none. Good. Walk it over to the other side. Excellent, we worked on those legs today. So let's do a little hip stretch real quick. So come into a kneeling position. Step your left foot forward, right knee is down, hands on your hips, and just press the hip toward the floor. Work through those hip flexors. Good. And then straighten your front leg and reach your hands toward your toes and stretch out through your hamstring. Good, one more time, let's rock forward the hips. Good, and then push back and get your hamstring. Excellent, switch sides, same thing. Push the hip forward, big breaths. Heart rate, heart rate is slowly coming back down. Straighten that front leg, reach for your toe. Think chest to the knee here. Good. One more time, push the hip forward. Good, and straighten that front leg, reach for your toe. Good. And let's return back to the hands and knees last time. And from here, tuck our toes and press our tailbone. One last time up to the ceiling. Down dog, and you can step one heel at a time or try to work both heels to the floor. Straighten through the legs, lift up through the hips. Good, and then walk your hands back to your feet. Good, walk your feet in and roll it up. And that is all I got for you. Nice work today, everybody. I appreciate your hard work and your effort. Uh, lean, protein, complex carbohydrates, lots of water. You know the drill. Uh, take care, everybody. I'll see you next time. Bye.